Right, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, do, do you have meetings? Do you, do you have to visit clients? I don't know. No, uh, I I will send an information and in, and some invoices. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. I will send some information. I will send some information. Okay, some information. Okay, okay. So, Yana, what time are you planning to stop working today? What time are you planning to leave the office today? Today. Today, yes. I, I think, I think I, fin I will fin finish, finish, will finish at... 5 p.m., 6 p.m. Ah, all right, all right, all right. Okay, okay. Diana, and tell me, how was your day yesterday? Uh, it was, okay. Ah, uh, it was relaxed. It was relaxing. Relaxing. It was relaxing. Okay, yesterday, okay. Yesterday, uh, yesterday, I... I was, I was, I was, este, I was drink. I was drink. H homework. Um, y yesterday, homework. yesterday I did homework. Yes. Uh -huh. Ayer yes. hice de tarea, ¿no? Sí. Okay, okay. Yesterday I did homework. Yes. Okay, okay, Diana, okay, okay. Diana, um, do you have a chance to check um, Recreo in Telegram? Ah, sí, eso. Este, de Telegram. No, 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 I don't. But, este, sí vi cómo era el proceso. Bueno. Okay, I saw, I saw how the process was. I saw how I saw the process, or I checked. How the process. I, was, ahí te lo voy a poner en el, en el cristal. Mm -hmm. Okay. I checked. Si lo puedes ver, cerrón. Sí. Pero yo no sé. I, yo sé. I checked. I checked how the process how. was. Okay. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Then, and tell me, what did you, what did you do after work? Yesterday, yesterday, what did you do after work? What did you do? What did you do after work yesterday? Ah, este. Después. Bueno, in, in the afternoon, uh, yes. I. In, este, I. I did homework. Very good. And uh, after este. ¿Cómo está? Then, este. Later. Later, very good, yes. Later, I I went to the to the gym. Very good. So to the to the to the gym and after very good. I este como sería I I start my I started very good. Uh, to to dance. To dance. Ah, dance. to dance at Zumba class, right? Uh -huh. Yes. Ah, all right, all right. Excellent. Yeah, yeah. And then, and after that, what do you have for dinner? What do you eat for dinner? Um, I, uh, I, I have a dinner. I eat for dinner. Uh, uh, I ate. I ate. I ate. Remember, I remember, ate. remember, remember. I ate. Mira, aquí. Remember. I ate. I ate a taco for dinner. For example, no? okay. you can say, I, or, recuerda que también puedes, puedes decir, I had a sandwich for dinner. Okay. Siempre después de, de ate, que obviamente el pasado, no? o de had, obviamente el pasado, siempre de ellos, después de ellos va lo, el producto. ¿sí? ¿Qué, lo, ¿Qué fue lo que comiste? ¿Sí? Okay. 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 So, okay. So, again, again. What did you have for dinner yesterday? I ate um, 
I ate some chicken salad. Very good. Delicious. Okay. Diana, did you cook the, the chicken salad or did you buy it? I, I, I cook it. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, very good. Diana, and what do you drink with the, with the chicken salad? Uh, we, uh, bueno, I drink, I uh, drunk, I, I drank. Remember exactly. I drank. I very good. Drank. Uh, um, some, oh, um, see, sí, some, este, weather. Ah, okay. I drank, very good, some, some pineapple. Pineapple. Pineapple weather. Delicious, Diana. Very good. Okay, delicious. Okay. Excellent. And what about for lunch? What do you eat for lunch? For lunch, um, uh, for lunch, uh, I I ate Very good. I ate um, a chicken sandwich. A chicken sandwich, okay. Yo, just one chicken, chicken sandwich or two chicken sandwiches? Uh, uh, one, one chicken chicken sandwich. Very good. Diana, uh, what do you drink with this chicken I, sandwich? I I drink, I drunk, I drank, I drank, I drank, I drank um, a glass of soda. Very good, excellent. Uh, Diana, <laughs> so you, you, Diana, you, you eat, look at this, you eat too little. Yes, Diana, you eat too little. Comes muy okay. poquito. Comes uh, muy poquito. Yes. <laughs> <Diana>. <laughs> Yes, uh -huh. I do. <laughs> and, and then, uh, what about your boyfriend? Does he eat? Does he? Wait, uh, does Does your boyfriend? Does your boyfriend eat too little? Uh, no, he doesn't. He uh, <laughs> he ate. Wait. He ate. Uh, a he, lot. He, he, he eats, recuerda, es, es presente, ¿no? he, he eats a lot. He okay. eats a lot. Okay. So, how many chicken sandwiches did he eat yesterday? How many chicken sandwiches did your boyfriend eat yesterday? Um, he, a ver, esta sería, he Okay, he ate. Very good. In 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 on site in the work in. The ah, plant. exactly, exactly, exactly. He he worked, so it was he ate, he ate he um ate. at the at the plant, okay. The plant. In the plant. Ah, okay, 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 okay. But, um, but in <laughs> in. In, ¿cómo se dice? In the dinner. Ajá, for, for, remember, for dinner. For, for, for dinner, dinner, he yes. ate, he ate a lot. He ate. <laughs> Very he good. He ate a yes. lot. Of, Very good. A lot. Very good. He ate, he ate a lot of salad. Salad, for dinner. Okay, ah, exactly. Okay. Very good. He ate a lot of salad, very good, yes, for dinner. Ah, okay, Diana, okay, okay, okay. Very good, Diana, very good, okay. Excellent, Diana, and did you watch any TV program yesterday? Um, program? Uh, no, yes, no, TV, I, no, I... Any TV no, program, any series, any, any series, any movies? No, I don't. No, okay. Uh, no. Okay, uh, okay. Esto sería we we este we come back at home. Come, uh -huh. come, come, we we came so back home. Came, we came, came back, back home. home later. Ah, late. 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 We, we come late. Ah, okay. What time did you arrive home? 
um, uh, at, we came back home at the 10 p.m. 10 p.m. Oh, late. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Very good. Enough. So, no time for television yesterday. No. Okay. No, Excellent. we don't. No. Okay. Okay. Then, um, what about um, today? Do you, do you have any plan? Any plans today with him? Uh, uh, after work, obviously. After work, I yes. I went. Ah, este. Here, I I am taking uh, other other English class. Okay. But but is bueno o, o that that is it is um, Tuesday and Thursday. Thursday. Tuesday, Tuesday is and Tuesday. and Thursdays. Thursday. Tuesdays. 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 And, and Thursdays. Thursdays. Ah, okay, okay. And in the afternoon, yes. I, I, I will take Very this good. class. Ah, you can say in the afternoon. You can say in the afternoon. In the afternoon. Okay. I'm going to take. I'm going I am, to take. I'm going to take. Uh, these classes. These classes. Ah, okay. Then are they also online classes or face to face classes? It's online classes. It's online. Ah, okay, uh -huh. okay, 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 okay. This is this is the. Uh, the how how would the última clase? Okay. This this will be or well, this is, this is going to be going to the last class. The last class. Ah, okay. And then, and, and where did the teacher from? Where is that teacher from? The teacher is Argentine. Ah, Argentina. he's from, uh, from Argentina. Yes. Ah, yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, they, they, they say, they say, boss. Boss. I don't like. <laughs> <laughs> ah, like boss, like referring to, to usted? You or see you? Ah, sí, yes. For, for them, you. Ah, sorry. For them, out. Oh. For them, you is uh, in Mexico is to usted, ustedes. But uh -huh. in Argentina is what? In Argentina is to y vos. No, in Argentina uh, is vos. Vos. Vos para tú. Ustedes, bueno, cualquier cosa. <laughs> ah, okay. ok, 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 So today you, you, you will have your last class and then uh, what time you have, uh, Anita? Uh, the class, the, this class. Very good. Uh -huh, is at 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Uh, our... Este, bueno, ahora en Argentina. Argentinian time. Ayer, Mira, Argentinian time. Mira, Argentinian time. Argentinian time. Ah, okay. Is it one hour, two hours, three hours? Sí. One hour, half. Half. Okay. One hour. Ya sé, ya sé. One hour okay. and a half. And a one hour and a half, una hora y media. Ah, uh -huh. okay, okay, Anita, okay. And Anita, and how, how is the connection? I mean, what, what technology does he use to connect with you? Uh -huh. Zoom, Google Meet, uh -huh. Teams, I don't know. It's, it's, it's for Zoom. Zoom, okay. Uh -huh. Okay, okay, very good, Anita, okay. Okay, so, what about it? Um, do, you, do you have any plans after the class? What are you going to do after the class? Uh, I went, bueno, no quiero. I, I 
I want to dress. I will go to the gym. <laughs> <laughs> I I want in in this is gym. Uh, yes. Uh, here, 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 yes. uh, Paul. 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 O sea, de, na, na, Alberta. Ah, yo creo que say, in this gym, in this the gym, gym, there is a pool. There is a pool. There is a pool. Hay, en ese gimnasio, ah, great, Nathan. So, Diana, are you, are you going to swim? Are you going to swim? I, I want... I will want. Are you going to swim? Vas a nadar? Vas a nadar. Ah, este. I, I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know swim. Ah, okay, okay. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, okay. I don't know how to swim. How to swim. And no sé nadar. I don't know. Ah, okay, 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 okay. But I... One, I, I will want, pero I want okay. to learn. Okay. Or to pero practice. But I want to learn okay, to swim. To I swim. want to learn to swim. Okay. También puede decir así, mira. O sea, esa es correcta. What I want to learn to swim es, es gramáticamente está bien. También puede decir así, but, but I... I would like to learn to swim. But okay. I would like to learn I to would swim. Like to learn to swim. Y es, es lo mismo, ¿ok? Quiero aprender a nadar o me gustaría aprender a nadar. Ok. Ah, ok. Are you taking, are you taking swimming classes? No, I am not. Ok, ok. No, I am not. When, Danita, when are you going to take uh, swimming classes? Este, is, is free, free pole? Free pole. Ajá, pero así le llaman. Ah, ok, la like idea free, free pole, la like idea Free, free, es como Alberta Libre. Ah, yes, it's, it's, it's a... It's a public pool. Is um, it public? No. 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 Es que okay. como que en horarios dan clases y cuando no es no dan clases es libre. Ah, okay. For, for, for all the people at the gym. At the gym, yes. Ah, okay. So it's a free pool. Okay, 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 okay. okay. So there is no or, or there are there are no um, swimming teachers. Are there any swimming teachers? Eh, um, are there any? Este, yes, 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 they are. Yes, yes there are. Mira, así se there. Yes, yes, there are. There are. Yes, ah, okay, 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 okay. So after your class, you are going to go to the gym, okay, to do exercise, okay. And and then Anita, after the gym, what are you going to do? Um uh, I I I back I came back at home. ¿Cómo, cómo, cómo Voy a regresar a casa. Voy I, a re regresar a casa. ¿Cómo dirías? Voy a, voy a regresar a casa. Voy a... Este es el... I am going. Very good. I am going to... I am going to... Okay. To go... Mira, back home. Okay. I am going to go back home. Voy a regresar a casa. Ah, okay, 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 very good. Very good. So it, it sounds like your day, exactly. It, your day, your day sounds really busy. Yes. Your day sounds 
Really busy, Anita. Ok. Ok. Pero idea. Yana, and what about um, this weekend? What about Saturday and Sunday? Do, do you have any plans for Saturday and Sunday? Um, we are planning. Very good. We are planning um, go to go out. Excellent. To go out uh, at a club, a nightclub. Okay, very good, very good. You can say, we are planning. We are planning to go out to a nightclub. Oh, great, Anita. And uh, until, until now, no sé si yes. eso es bueno. Ajá, un now, hasta ahora. Ajá. Okay, very good data. Excellent. Excellent. Dina, and are you are you going to go to the cinema this weekend? Uh, are you going to go to the cinema this weekend? No, I am not. Uh, okay. The cine, el, bueno, the cine look look como sería look look it. Ah, the cinema si es en presente the cinema looks the o si es en pasado looks, Ajá, looks. Ajá. sería the cinema looks este, este, este quiero decir feo <laughs> <laughs> the cinema looks <laughs> ugly um, Ugly. The cinema looks like. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Why, there it is. Why is it? Uh, do, mira, does, does it look? Does it look old? Or does uh -huh. it look? Does it look? Um, I don't know. Dirty. I don't know. Se ve viejo. Se ve sucio. I don't know. Yo creo que este de cine de cinema looks dirty. Or I mean, y, y, o, o tal vez no, tal vez sí es como no es un cinepolis, quiero decir este es este es eh, puede ser de cine de cinema looks old and small, very small. The, the yes. films, the yes. films are old. Oh, really? Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> the, este, <laughs> in Mexico, the films are in the TV, <laughs> casi in the, in, the, in, in, exactly. sería, in and, online. And, exactly. and here, and here, um, Apenas están cartelera, no sé cómo sería esto. Ah, ah, so here they are showing, let's see, they are showing, they are showing mm -hmm. as premier movies, ¿no? Here they are showing as premier movies. Están, están, yes. showing? Aquí, aquí se están presentando como si fueran películas nuevas. Ajá. Es? Ok. Yes. Ok, ok, ok. Wow, I didn't know. Ok, I didn't know that. Ok, ok. Very good, very good. We, we... ¿Qué pasó? We walked... Uh, we walked... De comprar, quiere decir, we walked... O oh, we shop... Este... Ah. Uh, ¿Cómo se llama? Este. Eh, eh, ah, y el que refleja. Proyector. Project, project, ah. Proyector. We bought. We bought. Mira, con un overhead proyector. Okay. Todo junto. Overhead proyector, un proyector. We bought an overhead proyector. Ah, yes. Yes. Y and eh, the films. Uh, look, the films look uh, 
Este, very, very good. <risa> ok, ahí está. Eso okay. es, is a home cinema. Exactly, exactly. So, <risa> you, you project the movies on the walls of, of your house. Y just on the house. Exactly, at the house. Ok, ok. Ok, good, good, excellent, excellent, very good, ok. So, Edita, very good. So, so cinemas, old and dirty. That's so bad, Edita, that's so bad. And Edita, what about, um, what about malls? What about malls in, uh, in Argentina? Are they good malls or bad malls or modern malls or old, old malls? Ahí está. Eh, yes. Dice, bueno, sería. Um, here, in, in. Yes. This, here, there, there, there are. No. Ahí. There are two, two malls, two small malls. Oh, two small malls? Yes. Okay. Okay. Um, how? Look at that. How? How do they look? How mm. do they look? Um, the malls look look good. Okay. But there there is not variety variety. Okay. You can say, I can say that there isn't, there isn't, there, there isn't much of this variety. There isn't much variety. No hay mucha variedad. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Okay, 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 okay. And, and Diana, uh, what is the, the typical soda in Argentina? Is, is there uh, a typical soda in Argentina? Yes, the typical soda is the mate. 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 Uh -huh. Ah, okay, okay, okay. That that is tea, right? Is is a tea. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Good. No, 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 I have never, I have never drunk mate. Okay. Is 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 it good? I I I. ¿Cómo sería? I don't like the mate. <laughs> no. It's, no. Why no, did it? Like why? Look, look. Uh, it's a, it, it is, it is a, a tea. Uh -huh. But more, more strong. Okay. Look at it. It is, it is, it is. like, like tea, it's, but it is like. it's a, but the flavor, but the flavor is stronger. Flavor is but the flavor is stronger. Mira, okay. Es como té, pero el sabor es más fuerte. ¿Eso uh -huh. es? Sí, yes. Ah, oh, ok, ok. <laughs> no. I don't I never... No? <laughs> no. <laughs> ok. Very good. The, the other, the other, uh, the other, este, drink. Very good. Is. It's a wine. Oh, ah, it's wine. wine. It's wine. wine. Oh, okay, yes. okay. And um, I think wine is good, no? I think wine is good. Uh, yes, it's, it's good. Okay, okay, okay. It's, okay. it's good and and cheap. Good and cheap, uh, yes? <laughs> yes. <laughs> How much does it cost a, a bottle of wine? Um, um, a one wine, uh, oh, one very wine, uh, cost, what? cost, um, this is in common, uh, 100. 100 Mexican pesos? Yes. It's cheap? It's cheap. Exactly. It, uh, so it's, it's, is good wine. Good, good, good wine. Diana, and what about um, 
What about eating in restaurants? Let's imagine, oh, well, I'm sure you and your boyfriend have eaten in good restaurants in Argentina. How much does it cost to eat in a good restaurant in, in Argentina? Okay, you can see that. Um, um, we, we, how would it be? Hemos ido. Ajá, hemos. Eso, ahí va, mira, ahí va. Eso es un tiempo que aún, que aún no vemos, pero que lo vamos a ver más adelante. Okay, mira. We have gone, por ejemplo, tú puedes decir, we have gone to, por ejemplo, to different um, restaurants. Mira. ¿Qué dice ahí? Hemos ido a diferentes restaurantes. Ese tiempo de ahí también, el tiempo we have gone, se llama presente perfecto. Pero eso todavía no lo vemos. Entonces lo vamos a ver más adelante. ¿no? Hemos ido a diferentes restaurantes. Aquí sería we have eh, spent. We have spent, ajá. We have spent, este, sí, por los dos como, a ver, fuera como 20 mil, que eso es como, no, hombre, no. A ver, no sé ni cuánto es. Ah, este, spend eh, 900. 900 pesos. Yes. Ok. For, for, It's cheap. For, for two... Oh. Eh, meats, eh, cortes, meats. Ah, for two, you can say. For two, for two, meat cuts. Meat cuts. Cortes de and, carne. Meat. And salad, and meat. wine, y okay. and beers. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Good day, then. so it, it not, it not expensive. How much does it cost, uh, or what is the conversion between Mexican peso and Argentinian peso? For example, for let's imagine for one, for for one Mexican peso equals to how many Argentinian pesos? Ah, uh, I cannot. Uh, no, 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 no. Me, uh, uh, me sé el, ah. el un un one dólar. Okay. One dollar Mexican, un one dollar is a yes. uh, nineteen este Mexican peso, ¿no? Ah, exacto, exacto. Nineteen, exacto. Nineteen. Nineteen or twenty, exacto. Nineteen or twenty no. Mexican pesos, okay. And here, un un one dollar is a uh, Three thousand eighty, eighty, eighty. Three thousand and eighty. And eighty. Este quiere decir no. Hundred is hundred. Three hundred. Three hundred. Three hundred and eighty Argentina pesos. Yes. Oh, that's too bad. Okay, that's. <laughs> Oh, yes. So, no, terrible, it's terrible. So it's uh, the dollar there is very expensive. Yes. Here, oh. after the after the World Cup. Yes. Uh, here, uh, ¿cómo sería? Devaluó todo. <laughs> ah, yes. The the currency. You're gonna say the, the currency went went down. Es la, la moneda local, la moneda local bajó, porque se devaluó. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, that's so bad. And, then, and, and, and what is the, the, the salary, or what is the standard salary in Argentina? How much is, is the the standard salary in Argentina. 
No, hay... Al, alguien dijo, pero... Al, some, somebody, somebody es alguien. Very good. Recuerda, recuerda, recuerda. Puedes puede decir somebody o puedes decir someone. Es lo mismo, ¿ok? Someone. Somebody or someone. Some, some, someone yes. says yes. Eh, that, that a person Good. is the... Ay, no es win, no es win este... Ah, no. ¿Cómo, cómo, cómo se dice? Mira. A person... A person... Earns. 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 Gana. Earns. 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 Pues bueno, sería, uh, por ejemplo, a... Uh, um, a uh, engineer... A uh, engineer... Of a... Uh, uh, big... Big enterprise... Years, eh, 30 thousands per month. 30 thousand Argentinian. No, eh, Mexican. Ya, ya cometí. Ah, okay, Mexican, okay, 30, per, mes, per mes. Mexican pesos, ok. Ah, ok. Pero, in a big enterprise. Exactly, in, in an important company. Ajá, uh -huh, yes. Ok. Bueno, uh, pues, bueno here, as you know, here in Mexico, the standard salary is, you know, you know that, okay, the standard salary in Mexico is like, uh, I don't know, between 4,000, between 4,000 or 5,000 Mexican pesos, ¿no? Yes. Yeah, here in Mexico, that, that is like the, the standard salary in Mexico, ¿no? And what about this? Uh, uh, but this is, this is, is this is, este, salary is for an engineer uh, okay. and a big um, enterprise. In Mexico, okay. this is situation, yes. uh, the, the people earn uh, uh, to double, uh, bueno, the, the ah. double. Yes, ah, yes. yes. So in this in, in Mexico, it's like um, in Mexico is like um, 60,000 pesos. Yes, more, more, more or less. Ah, oh, so it's a, oh, I don't know, some, it's, it's, it's about salary there in Argentina it's a, it's, because here in, here in Mexico it is the double. Yes. And in Argentina is the half, in the mitad, in the half. The half. Oh, cabal, that's a, and, and even this salary is for a, a special case. I mean, for an Argentinian <laughs> engineer working in a very good company, no? Yes. So this is a, like a, like the exception, I, I, I think. Yes. Okay. It's, <laughs> it's very, it's, it's rare, very rare, rarely. Exactly, exactly. It's very, exactly, you can say, it's very, it's uh, it is a very a very, a very rare condition. Rare condition. No. Yes. Oh, 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 it's terrible. No, and, and considering this, okay, one dollar is three hundred and eighty. Yes. Terrible. The, terrible. The, the people, the people are. Eh, Hungry? No, hungry is hambriento. Is the is the molesto? No, 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 no. Yes, you can say, you can say, Argent, Argentinian Argentina. people are angry. Yes. Angry. Eno, enojados. ¿Cómo se dice hambriento? Mira, hambriento. Hungry. 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 Hambriento. Okay. Angry, enojado, molesto. Ajá. And why, why, Anita? Why are Argentinian people Angry. Uh, because your money, uh, o sea, no ganan lo que gastan. Ah, uh, because you, you can say, 
because they they money. They money. They money is not enough. No, porque su dinero no es suficiente. Oh, qué man. No, this with this is too bad, Anita. Too bad. Yes. Even for us in Mexico, this is sad, okay? For us in Mexico, this is sad, okay? Imagine, imagine, 300 pesos for one dollar. Terrible. Yes, it's terrible. Uh, terrible, Anita, terrible. Uh, uh, that is for dollar, Anita. Imagine, Diana, imagine for, for, look at this, imagine for, for one euro. Imagine, okay. im, imagine for one euro, okay? Or im, imagine, Janita, imagine for one sterling pound. Mm -hmm. What, do, do, do you know what it is, Janita? What is sterling pound? Es este, esterlinas, ¿no? Eh, Exactamente, la, li, la libre esterlina. Exactly. Libre, sí. Imagine, Diana, for one sterling pound, okay? It sure oh, is easy oh, okay. for, for, for este, oh, no. even in Mexico, even in Mexico, one sterling pound in Mexico right now is around, around 24, 24 pesos or 26 pesos. Imagine in Argentina. No, yeah, that's terrible, terrible, eh? terrible, terrible. It's terrible. Okay. Very good. Okay, so let, let's continue with, with the revision for the exam, okay? Okay. Remember, remember we are having an exam. So here I wrote grammar review. Let's start with present continuous, okay? For you, it should be any problem. He says, look at the picture. It says, Grace and it's about Jane. Use she is ing or she isn't ing. For example, it says, have dinner. Jane isn't having dinner, okay? Mm -hmm. He says, watch TV. He says, she is watching TV, okay? What about the sit on the floor? She? She isn't sitting on the floor. A ver, ahí escríbele. She? Ah, estoy... <laughs> ahí estaba en la... Anterior. Ya no vas a cargar. <laughs> <laughs> Ya está aquí. Ah, ya la vi. Ya está. Ahí está. Ahí está. Ahí está. Ah, but she no no necesita. Look, look ahead. She she ah. sitting on the floor, no? Sí, sí, sí. Ah, uh -huh. she sitting on the floor. I mean, she is not sitting on a chair. Así. Okay. Mira, necesita. ¿Cómo cómo se llama este? Mira, necesita este. This is piano, ¿no? This is a piano. Okay. ¿Y este necesita? ¿Cómo se llama este? Es... Este, ¿no? Mm, no, no es como bank. Mira, ahí te va. That is a bench. Bench. Bench, ok. That is a bench, ok. Eso es banco también. Banco, exactamente. Pero un banquito para sentarse, ¿no? Ok, bench. Pero si te encuentras muy bien. Dice, read a book. Eh... She, Very good. she isn't reading a book. Excellent. She isn't, she isn't reading a book. Excellent. Do you explain the piano? She isn't playing the piano. Excellent. She isn't. Playing the piano. Good. Laugh. Laugh. What is laugh, Anita? Do you, do you remember? How do you say laugh in Spanish? Es escuchar. Escuchar, mira. Escuchar. Mira, 
Listen. Listen, Listen escuchar. Ah, ya sé, es este riendo. Very good. Reírse, ¿no? Reírse. En, la forma, en la forma simple, reírse. Very good. Reírse. Entonces, sería she, she is learning. She isn't. Ah, yes, she is, yes, sir. No, sí, 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 sí. She is loving, loving, loving. She is loving. Love. Love. Loving, exactamente. Love. Lo, loving. loving, loving. Este es love, love, loving, loving. She is loving. loving, okay, pretty good. Wait, wear, wear a hat. Um, este, she, she is wearing a hat. Very good, she's no. wearing a hat. Parece más, más que, que sombrero, pues un, un, una gorra, ¿no? Ajá. Eso sí, es, es una gorra. Ajá. Sí, entonces sería, ¿cómo se dice? Ella no está usando un sombrero. She isn't, she isn't wearing a hat. Very good. She isn't. Friend. Excellent. What about that drink coffee? Drink coffee. She isn't drinking coffee. Excellent. She isn't drinking coffee. Okay. So, she isn't drinking. Look at this. Coffee. Okay. Double, uh -huh. double F, okay, double E, okay, very good, okay. Mira lo que dice, what is happening now? Write true sentences. For example, I'm not washing my hair, okay? It is snowing or it, it isn't snowing, dice. Escribe enunciados de acuerdo a la realidad, a lo que pase ahora, ¿no? Por eso, Anita, okay. I sit on a chair. ¿Cómo se llama, Anita? Uh -huh. I am um, okay. I am I am sitting on a chair. Very good. I am sitting. Excellent. I am sitting on a chair. Good. I eat. I am not. Excellent. Eating. Very good. I am not eating. Good thing. What about it rain? It isn't raining. Excellent. It isn't raining. Good. I study English. I am studying English. Very good. I am studying English. Good. Well, I, I listen to music. I am not listening to music. Very good. Excellent. Well, the sunshine. ¿Qué será de esto? Shine. ¿Qué será? ¿Qué será shine? Mira, te, lo, te lo pongo aquí abajo, mira, shine. Es un verbo, mira. El pasado es shone. Ok. Shine, shone. Shine. Es un verbo. Es un verbo. Ahí te va. Es shine, bri, brillar. Brillar. Shine, brillar. Okay. El pasado, Sean brilló. Okay. Es un verbo irregular. Shine brillar, Sean brilló. Okay. Entonces, ahí tiene que decir, ¿el sol está brillando o el sol no está brillando? Ok. The sun is shining. 
Very good. The sun, the sun is shining. The sun. The sun is the shining. Sun is shining. Very good. The sun is shining. Good. What about I? I wear shoes. <laughs> I am. Um, I am. Um, I am not wearing. Very good. Shoes. Shoes. Good. It says I read a newspaper. I am not reading Very good. a news paper. Very good. <laughs> excellent. Good, excellent. Okay, yes. write these verbs with S or ES, okay? For example, she reads, okay? He, he, well, he thinks. Very good. He thinks. Good. Okay, the number three. It flies. It flies. It flies. 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 Very good. Oh, fly. Yes, yes. Perfect. Yes. Good. Flies. Very good. Yes. It flies. Good. He. Dances. Excellent. Good. She has. Very good. Finish. It finish finishes. Very good. It finishes. Great. Okay. You just complete the sentences about the people in the pictures. Use, for example, eat, go, live, play, play, sleep. For example, number one. It says, my piano. No? He says, he plays the piano. Look, look at number two. They in a very big house. They live. Li they live. Very good. They live. Very good. In a very really big house. Excellent. Well, uh, number three, okay. Is a lot is of fruit. Very good. She eats. Excellent. A lot of fruit. Very good. Okay. Look at number four. It says tennis. It says tennis is my favorite sport. Uh, he plays tennis. Excellent. He plays. Good. It. He says to the movies is a we love movies number five. Huh? To the movies a lot. Um, uh, to the movies a lot. Exactly. But they know they they go. They go. They, go. Not, no? they go to the movies. Okay. Exactly. Yes. She's seven hours a night. He sleeps. Very good. Seven hours. He sleeps. Seven hours a night. Very good. Excellent. Okay. Look, it says, write the negative. It says, I play the piano very well. Negative, I don't play the piano very well, okay? Look at number two. Anna plays the piano very well. Anna doesn't play the piano very, very well. Great. Anna doesn't play the piano very well. Excellent. They know my phone number. They don't know. Very good. My cell, my, my, my phone, phone, my phone, my phone, my phone number. Phone. 
Excellent. Just, we work very hard. We we don't. Excellent. We don't work very hard. Very good. Let me get number five. Mike has a car. Mike do doesn't have a car. Very good. Excellent. Good. Good. You do the same thing every day. You don't. Very good. You don't do good. the same thing every day. Excellent. Good. Perfect. Perfect. Now it says, here we are going to practice either present continuous or simple present. Aquí vamos a practicar ambos. Present continuous o present simple. Okay? It says, complete the hands with amis are or do, don't, those, doesn't. For example, excuse me, do you speak English? Um, okay. Where is Kate? I know. Uh, I, I don't know. Very good. I don't know. Excellent. He says, what's so funny? Why? Why? Why are you laughing? Laughing. Laughing. Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing? Laughing. Good. Laughing. What do you sister do? She's a dentist. What are your sister do? Are you sure? No. Okay. Te voy a ir, mira, mira, espera, te la voy a poner aquí. Si tú me dices, what are your sister do? Okay. Ahí está, eh. Si tú me dices así, what are your sister do? ¿Qué dice ahí? ¿Qué está tu hermana a hacer? ¿Qué uh -huh. está tu hermana a hacer? Okay. Sería... No, 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 no cuadra, ¿no? Sí. Ajá. What do your sister do? What uh, does? Very good. Yes, exactly. What good does Anita. your sister do? ¿Por qué does? Porque si cambiamos a your sister por un pronombre, sería she. Ella. Sí. Ajá. Quedaría, what does she do? Sí. Very Ajá. good. Okay. Good night. Look at number five. It's raining. It is raining. Very good. It is raining. I want to go out in the rain. Esta. I want, queda así, ¿no? Exactly, yes. Pero aquí, aquí tiene que ser yo no quiero salir en la lluvia. Ah, I don't Así. want. Very good. I don't want to go out, go out in, in the, the rain. rain. Very good. Number six, where you come from? Where, where do you come from? Very good. Exactly, Canada. How much it costs to stay at this hotel? Is it expensive? Uh, is it should just say I wanna okay, think it's gonna get the well up get I get it he said quanto es eso costar quedarse en el hotel okay si, si no tuviera cosa ahorita se si quedaría mira mira sería así how much is it how much is it? How much is it to stay? To stay at this hotel. How much is it to stay at this hotel? 
fíjate, si no tuviera coast, si no tuviera palabra coast, si quedaría. ¿Cómo si sí, tú estás ahí? ¿Qué dice ahí? ¿Cuánto cuesta o cuánto es quedarse en ese hotel, en este hotel? ¿no? Pero mira, como tiene, como tiene el verbo coast, ¿sí? el, el verbo coast no, no se lleva con el verbo cero estar. Exactamente. Bueno, el, ajá. ¿Cuál sería esto? ¿Cuál sería? Sería dos. ¿Cómo es dos? Exactamente. ¿Y recuerda por qué? ¿Por qué dos? Porque tienes el verbo coast. Por eso. Si no tuvieras el verbo coast, sí quedaría. How much is it to stay? Ambas, ambas formas. How much does it cost to stay at this hotel? O how much is it to stay at this hotel? Es lo mismo. ¿okay? Ambas preguntan lo mismo. ¿Puede, eso puede ser también, por ejemplo, si fuera con el is, is. How much is it costing to stay at this hotel? hotel? Yeah. Yeah. How much is it costing to stay at this hotel? ¿Cómo es? Ajá. Sonaría muy raro. Es muy raro, Anita, ¿ok? ¿Cómo much is it costing? ¿Cuánto está costando quedarse en ese hotel? Sonaría muy extraño. Sí. O sea, gramaticalmente está bien, ¿sí? Cumple con la regla de la gramática, pero en cuanto a uso, sonaría muy extraño. Raro. Exactamente. Ok. Ok, ok. okay. okay. How much does it cost to stay at this hotel? This hotel. Okay. Cuida, bueno, número 8. Es tío. Es un buen tenis player. But he. 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 Este, he plays very often. Ah, no. He don't. He do, doesn't play. Very good. Very good, very good, very good. Doesn't play very often. But he doesn't mm -hmm. play very often. Excellent, Anita, very good. So here, Anita, any question, Anita, with these topics? Question mm -hmm. with simple present, present continuous, the combination of simple present and present continuous, No, está, está bien. Ok, 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 ok. Está bien, está bien. Muy bien, muy bien. Let, let's check the book, ok. Very good. Ok, muy bien. Wait a minute, ok. Muy bien. So, let, let's see. Okay, can you see the book? Mm -hmm. You can read the book? Okay, very good. Okay, yes. so let's say, let's say here, beer days, okay, beer days, okay? Vamos a practicar, okay, tú ya sabes que es muy fácil, okay? Yeah. Repetimos, repetimos. January. January. February. February. March. March. April. April. May. May. June. June. July. July. August. August. September. September. October. October. November. November. December. December. Otra vez. January. January. February. February. March. March. April. April. May. May. June. June. July. July. August. August. September. September. October. October. November. November. December. December. 
yo digo, mi milagrito. Ellos obviamente son los meses del año. Hay, hay una regla para ellos, mira, por ejemplo, aquí lo voy a poner. Por ejemplo, para decir en, en marzo, ¿sí? Mira, ahí está, en marzo. Para decir en junio, en junio. Para decir en, 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 en septiembre, en septiembre. ¿Sí? Pero, ¿qué pasa cuando ponemos la, el mes y la fecha? Por ejemplo, mira así: on March 5. On March 5. Ok. Por ejemplo, on. On June 20. On June 20. Ok. On. Ok. On September 15. Sí. Es así. Si únicamente dices el mes solito, tienes que usar in. In March, in June, in September. Pero si dices el mes y, y, y la fecha, hay que usar on. On March 5, on June 20, on September 15. Sí. Ok. Por ejemplo, mira, hablando de birthdays, yo te puedo preguntar, when is your birthday? When is your birthday? Uh, my birthday is on February 10. February, ok. February 10. Ok. Anita, okay. when is your, your, your boyfriend's birthday? My... Bueno, sería... Tú puedes decir, his birthday. His birthday. His birthday, his birthday. is on May 14. 14. May 14. Ok, exacto. Bueno, Anita, your mother. When is your mother's birthday? Uh, her birthday. Very good. Is on January 24. January. January 24. 24. Very good. Okay. Okay. Mira, te, te lo número final. Hay una regla que dice. La nueva regla del inglés americano dice que los números, cuando se usan con fechas, se dicen en la forma simple, así. May 14, January 24, ¿sí? February 10, así que. Eso es inglés americano, ¿ok? Antiguamente, antiguamente en inglés americano y actualmente también en inglés británico, dice que hay que usar números, ¿ok? Como este, mira, por ejemplo. On May 14. Mira. Y, y de hecho, para inglés de negocios, se utiliza así. Con esta terminación. On May 14. On January. January 24. En números ordinales. ¿sí? Entonces, recuerda. Para inglés moderno, inglés americano, lo puedes decir así. Normal. Sin terminación. Para inglés de negocios, ¿sí? O inglés más formal, tienes que escribirlo con la terminación. 14, 24, ¿ok? Pero mira, la, es, la el... pronunciación, perdón, es, ¿se oye igual? No, mira, aquí sería 14, 14, 14, 24, 24, 24. Va a ser, por ejemplo, este, por ejemplo, February 10, ¿no? Sería on February. Mira, on February 10th. On February 10th. 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 On February 10th. Otra regla de inglés. Los meses, no importando en qué posición del enunciado se encuentren, los meses siempre van escritos con mayúscula. En español no. En español lo escribimos con minúscula, ¿no? Creo que, que de hecho en español es eh, en contra de la gramática española escribir los meses con mayúscula inicial. Se escriben con, con minúscula, ¿no? 
a menos que vayan al principio del anuncio, del anunciado, ¿no? En español. Pero en inglés siempre, no importa en qué posición esté en el enunciado, siempre se escribe con mayúscula inicial. ¿Sí? Very good. Ok. Vamos a ver aquí los números ordinales, mira. ¿Sí? Mira, repetimos, repetimos. First. First. Second. Second. Third. Third. Fourth. Fourth. Fifth. Fifth. Sixth. Sixth. Seventh. Seventh. Eighth. Eighth. Ninth. Ninth. Tenth. Tenth. Eleventh. Eleventh. Twelfth. Twelfth. Thirteenth. Thirteenth. Okay. Fourteenth. Fourteenth. Fifteenth. Fifteenth. Sixteenth. Sixteenth. Seventeenth. Seventeenth. Eighteenth. Eighteenth. Nineteenth. Nineteenth. Twentieth. Twentieth. Twenty first. Twenty first. Twenty second. Twenty second. Twenty third. Twenty third. Twenty fourth. Twenty fourth. Twenty fifth. Twenty fifth. Twenty sixth. Twenty sixth. Twenty seventh. Twenty seventh. Twenty eighth. Twenty eighth. Twenty ninth. Twenty ninth. Thirty. Thirty. Thirty first. Thirty first. Exacto, entonces, eh, entonces sí, sí identificamos la diferencia, por ejemplo, do, aquí obviamente es doceavo, treceavo, catorceavo, ¿no? Doce normal sería twelve, trece normal, thirteen, catorce normal, fourteen, pero aquí es twelfth, thirteenth, fourteenth, fifteenth, sixteenth. Y, mira, y, y, y de, los números tienen que ir a acompañados de la terminación con que termina por ejemplo aquí fourth termina con th fifth termina con th second mira, termina con nd ok por ejemplo first mira first con st y qué es primero segundo tercero cuarto quinto sexto séptimo octavo ¿Sí? okay. yes. uh -huh. y recuerda la verdad, ¿sí? Ellos utilizan para inglés formal y, por, y para inglés de negocios. ¿Okay? Es decir, mira, ¿cómo, ¿cómo te explica acá? ¿Cómo te explica aquí? Puedes decir perfectamente así, mira. On February 10, ¿ok? O on February 10, ¿sí? Mucho depende del contexto, ¿sí? Esto es para inglés informal, inglés con tus amigos, con personas que conoces, ¿sí? Y este es para inglés formal, inglés de negocios, inglés para presentaciones, ¿sí? Inglés para que tengas que, por ejemplo, enviar un reporte, enviar un informe. Este es el que hay que usar, ¿sí? Ok. Perfecto. Ok. Ok, so, le, let's continue. Ok, le, let's listen. Let's listen to the conversation, ok? Déjame cambiar para que pueda escuchar. Okay. ok. Obviamente, ahorita, esto es, es, es memoria. Ok. Es decir, uh -huh. No hay regla gramatical, más que es pura memoria. Ok. ¿Por qué? Porque es vocabulario. Ok. Ok. So, it's... Ok. Ok. Page 34. 1. Getting started. C. Listen to Alicia and her brother Dave. What are the three events on their calendar? Practice the conversation. It's mom's birthday on the first, remember? She's going to be 50. Oh, that's right. What are you going to get her? I'm going to buy her something special, 
like a necklace. Then it's on Dad's anniversary on the 10th. Right. We usually give them something. We? You mean I do. Let's um send them some flowers. Okay. Then it's my birthday on the 23rd. Yeah, I know. I'm going to get you the same thing you got me. Nothing. Okay, okay. so let me listen again, okay? Good. Page 34. 1. Getting started. C. Listen to Alicia and her brother Dave. What are the three events on their calendar? Practice the conversation. It's mom's birthday on the 1st, remember? She's going to be 50. Oh, that's right. What are you going to get her? I'm going to buy her something special, like a necklace. Then it's mom and dad's anniversary on the 10th. Right. We usually give them something. We? You mean I do. Let's um send them some flowers. Okay. Then it's my birthday on the 23rd. Yeah, I know. I'm going to get you the same thing you got me. Nothing. Okay, the you're Alicia, I am, I am Dave, okay? Okay. Okay, you start. It's mom's? Ah, yo soy Alicia. It's, yes. it's, okay. It's mom's birthday on the first. Remember? She's going to be 50. Or the slide. What are you going to get her? I'm going to buy her sometime special, like a necklace. 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 Very good. good. Then it's mom and dad's anniversary on the 10th. Right. You right. should give them something. We? You mean? You, we? You mean? Do. Let's. Uh, um, I do. I do. Ah, I do. You mean? I do. Let's um send them some flowers. Okay, then it's my birthday on the 23rd. Yeah, I know. I am going to get you the same thing you got me. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Very good. Okay. <laughs> good. Okay. So, yeah. Sorry, Sesame. Esto lo voy a poner en el pizarro, ¿ok? It says, complete the conversation, ¿ok? It says, use the conversation above to help, ¿ok? ¿ok? Vamos al pizarro, very good. Ok. Very good. Let me share it. Good. So it says practice the conversation. It says complete the conversation. Use the conversation above to help you, okay? Then practice with the partner. For example, what you buy your mom for next birthday? Get a kit to you. What are you, what are you going to buy? your mom for her next birthday, okay? I think, I think I, to, to, to explain, I think I, yeah. um, I, I think I said, voy a comprarle flores. Ah, I am going to get very good. Excellent. I am going to get her get her some flowers. Very good. Do you always buy? Very good. Aquí es el logo. Do you want? Do you always buy her? Do you always buy her something on her birthday? Do you always buy her something on her birthday? 
Mm -hmm. I mean, like that. yeah. Yeah. And when mom and dad's anniversary, I always send uh, their sunflowers. Sí, qué bonita. Ahí, ahí te puedes usar los pronombres de objeto. ¿Te acuerdas? Ah. Los pronombres sí. de objeto. Them. Very good. Send them some flowers, okay? Okay. Vamos a practicarlo. Ahí está. What are you going to buy your mom for next birthday? Uh, I think I am going to get her some flowers. Do you always buy her something on her birthday? Yeah. And on mom and dad's anniversary, I always send them some flowers. Very good. Excellent. Very good. Okay, Let, let's continue with the book, okay? Good. Okay. Ah, mira, en el libro viene. Pasa, déjame que un poco. No. Mientras, la voy a poner en el pizarrón. Ahí está. Ok. Ok, perfecto, ahí está. Viene la parte gramatical. Ya. Te lo presento. Okay. Here it, we are going to practice and we are going to learn going to. Okay. Mira, aquí lo pongo abajo. Be going to. Be. Be going to. Okay. Be going to. It is used. It is used to speak about the future. Okay. But a sure and near future. Okay. Para hablar del futuro, pero de un de un futuro cercano y de un futuro seguro que sí van a pasar. Okay. La gramática es muy sencilla. Por ejemplo, vamos a poner algunos ejemplos. Por ejemplo, I am going to visit my dad next week. Quiere decir que es una acción que sí la vas a realizar. Es una, una acción que quizás ya has planeado y que por seguro sí se va a realizar. O por ejemplo, Chile. Ahí, ahí en sí. español diría, yo voy a visitar a mi papá la siguiente semana. Es correcto. Voy a visitar, o sea, voy a visitar a mi papá. El going to es voy a. Exactamente, es correcto ahorita. Mira, por ejemplo, she is going to eat some uh, Mexican food uh, today afternoon. Okay. She's going to eat some Mexican food today afternoon. Ella va a comer, ella va a comer algo de comida mexicana hoy en la tarde. ¿Qué quiere decir? Quizás hasta alguien la invitó, quizás ya tiene el plan, quizás ya tiene la reservación. Es una característica de este tipo de futuro. En inglés hay aproximadamente 10 tipos de futuro. Okay. El más común es este, el pigo y todo. La condición es que es para acciones que sí se van a realizar y que son un futuro cercano. Son acciones que por seguro sí o sí se tienen que realizar o se van a realizar. ¿Por qué? Pues digo, a lo mejor ya tomaste por ahí alguna previsión. Por ejemplo, si es que vas a visitar a tu papá, a lo mejor ya le avisaste, o es un hábito que lo visitas cada semana, o si va a comer comida mexicana, a lo mejor ya hizo la reservación. ¿Puede, sí. ¿Puede, puede ser un, algo que va a pasar, pero que falte mucho? Buena pregunta. No necesariamente. Ese dinamita, ese futuro. Ajá. Que falte mucho. Es otro, fíjate. Es aquí, mira. Ese es con Will. Ah. Will es otra forma también de hablar de futuro. Pero Will, mira, aquí te voy a poner. Okay. It is used for actions okay, that are far in the future. And for actions that are not sure to happen. 
Ahí está. Fíjate la vocal. Mira, will es otra forma. Y se usa para acciones que están lejos en el futuro y para acciones que no está segura que pasen. Por ejemplo, se puede decir probably, 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 okay, I will go to Japan next year. Okay. Mira, will tiene muchos usos, ok. Uno de ellos es este, ¿sí? para hablar de acciones del futuro que están lejas, lejanas en el futuro y que no son seguras que ocurran. Como aquí, probablemente yo visitaré Japón el próximo año. Ok. O, okay. maybe, 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 ok. She will eat Mexican food, ok, to the afternoon. Que quiere decir que hay una, una probabilidad. Hay ciertos libros de gramática que dicen que la probabilidad de que ocurran las acciones con Will es del 50%. Con Will. Versus, versus going to. Hay libros de gramática que afirman que las acciones que, que, se, de, que se declaran con going to es un 100% seguro que sí se van a realizar. Ok. Ok, también. Okay, Veamos el, el negativo, por ejemplo. Mira, negativo. We aren't going to. The, we aren't going to go to the cinema tomorrow. Ok. No vamos a ir al cine mañana. Ok. Question. Question, por ejemplo. What? What are you going to do tonight. Okay. ¿Qué vas a hacer esta noche? Okay. Okay. La gramática, muy sencillo. Tenemos pronombre personal, personal pronoun, los be going to, los ver, los complement. Okay. Personal pronoun, los be going to, los ver, Plus complemento, ¿ok? Por ejemplo. I am going to study okay, tonight. Okay. I am going to study tonight. Voy a estudiar esta noche. Ok. A ver, Anita, ¿qué queda el turno? What are you going to do tonight, Anita? What are you going to do tonight? Uh, I am going to... To go at the gym, to go the gym, to the gym. I am going to go to the gym. To the gym. Okay, very good. Okay, 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 okay. Anita, what, what are you going to do? What are you going to do? Um, Uh, tomorrow, tomorrow afternoon. Afternoon. What are you going to do tomorrow afternoon? I am going to. Good. Um. Tiene que ser un verbo, ¿no? To to. Exacto. To, to dance. Very good. I am going to dance, okay, at the gym, no? At the gym. I am going to dance at the gym. Very good. Exactly. Later. Very good. Okay. Entonces, recuerda, mi y tú es para planes. Mira, oh, eso por aquí falta también. Oh, it used to speak about uh, aquí, okay. plan actions. Okay. Plan actions, okay, in the future. Ahí está. Se usa para hablar de acciones planeadas en el futuro, pero un futuro cercano y un futuro seguro de realizar. Ok. okay mira. El siguiente tema, ya lo habíamos visto, mira. Por ejemplo, mira. 
estos se relacionan con a ambas partes se relacionan con object pronouns. Okay. Con los pronombres de objeto. Como okay. usados como indirectos. Ok. O pronombres indirectos. Por ejemplo, mira aquí. I am going to buy my mother something special. Okay. I am going to buy my mother something special. ¿Cómo, cómo la camarilla necesita este enunciado usando un, un pronombre de objeto? I am going to buy my mother something special. A ver si aquí escribes. Aquí un ladito. ¿Cómo no cambia? I, I'm going Very good. to buy her something Very good. special. Very good. Exacto. Mira, justo como aquí, mira. Aquí abajo. I am going to buy her something special. Ok. Oh, no. Mira, uh -huh. Alicia isn't going to give Dave anything. Alicia isn't going to give Dave anything, ¿no? Que esa Alicia no le va a dar nada a Dave, ¿no? Como que Alicia isn't going to give him anything, ¿no? Let's send mom and dad some flowers. Let's send them some flowers. Ok. Ok. Mira, ahí está. Vamos a ir un poquito más allá. Mira, pasa. También como este, mira. Le voy a tomar este como ejemplo. I am going to buy my mother something special, ¿ok? Lo voy a poner aquí. Mira. I am I am going to buy my mother something special, ¿ok? También puedes decirlo así, mira. I am going to buy something special for my mother. ¿Sí ve la diferencia? Uh -huh. Después del verbo buy, en la primera enunciado, después del verbo buy está el, el sujeto, está la persona y después el objeto. Aquí, después del verbo buy está el objeto y después la persona. Es lo mismo ahí. Tú puedes decir, I'm going to buy something, I'm going to buy my mother something special, o I'm going to buy something special for my mother. Ok. Y voy con este, por ejemplo. Alicia, vamos a ver. Alicia. Alicia isn't going to give Dave anything, ¿no? Alicia isn't going to give Dave anything. Yes. Alicia no, no, no le va a dar nada a Dave. Pero también puede decir Alicia isn't going to give anything to Dave. Exacto. Alicia isn't going to give anything to Dave. Alicia no le va a dar nada a Dave. ¿Sí? Es lo mismo, ¿sí? Con cualquier forma que lo, que lo quieran expresar, es lo mismo. Mira el siguiente. Sí. Let's send. Mira, let's send. Let's send mom. Mom and dad. Some flowers. ¿Ok? ¿Ok? Mira. También puede decir así. Let's send some flowers to mom and dad. ¿Sí? Okay. Es exactamente lo mismo. O sea, cualquier forma en que lo quieras expresar, en el modelo 1 ¿sí? o en el modelo 2 es exactamente lo mismo. ¿Sí? ¿Cómo cambiaría Anita, este usando pronombres de objeto? Por ejemplo, dice el enunciado. I'm going to buy something special for my mother. ¿Cómo lo cambiaría de interés? No, por no me cuento. Um, pondría, I'm going to buy something special for her. Ok, I'm going to buy. I'm going to buy. 
Um, aquí al lado. Ah, o sea, yes, yes, yes. Ok. Y mira. Aún hay otra forma de cambiarlo, mira, así. I'm going to I'm going to buy it for her. Y okay. mira, I'm going to buy it for her. Obviamente, ahí está, hay una regla. ¿Cuál es la regla que te dije? De los pronombres de objeto. Primero en el diálogo tienes que mencionar de lo que estás hablando. ¿Sí? Porque si únicamente llegas en el diálogo y dices, I'm going to buy it for her, no se entiende sí. nada, ¿eh? No, sí. no sabe qué es lo que vas a comprar y mucho menos para quién, ¿no? Ok. A ver, Anita, cambiaste. Alicia isn't going to give anything to Dave. A ver, cambiando los dos, a ver. A ver, Alicia isn't going to Give. Anything lo cambiamos por it. 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 To him. Exactamente. Ahí está. Exacto. Exacto. ¿Ves cómo así, eh, con ese cambio en, en los dos, en el objeto directo, que es en la cosa, y el objeto indirecto, que es la persona, ¿Ves cómo en este cambio ahí se queda muy, muy abstracto, no? Alicia isn't going to give it to him. ¿no? O sea, es un significado muy, muy, muy oculto que si no se menciona previamente, no se entiende. No, ¿no? se entiende. Uh -huh. okay, exacto. A ver, ahorita, let's send some flowers to mom and dad. Let's... Cambiar dos. Send Let's send. Let's send. Recuerda, hay que cambiar some flowers. Flowers. Y hay que cambiar mom and dad. Send them. Very good. Uh -huh. To them. Exacto, exacto. Let's okay. send them to them. Exacto. ¿Ves que, cómo, cómo así queda tan, tan, tan oculto el, el, el mensaje? ¿no? Let's send them to them. Vamos, uh -huh. te digo, te vuelvo a repetir. ¿no? Si lo dices solamente así en un diálogo, let's send them to them, no te van a entender mal. O sea, enviarles qué a quién. Qué a quiénes, sí. ¿no? Por eso, una de las reglas de los pronombres de objeto es que previamente tiene que haberse mencionado en el diálogo. ¿Sí? Como aquí, a lo mejor yo te digo, ah, Diana, let's send some flowers to mom and dad. Y ya tú me dices, ah, yes, Miguel, let's send them to them. Obviamente, ya sabemos a qué nos referimos. Ajá. Yes, very good, Anita. Ok, ok. Let, let, okay. Let's see. Aquí, Anita, any questions with going to, Anita? Something difficult with going to? Este. Pero sí, por ejemplo, si, por ejemplo, yo, yo estoy diciendo que mañana voy a ir a, digo, que al rato voy a ir al gimnasio, porque yes. este, ese es el plan que tengo, ¿no? Pero okay. si por cualquier cosa no llego a, o sea... ¿A ir? No, no quiero decir, por decir, ¿no? Este, voy a ir al gimnasio, es mi plan pero el, el cielo se está medio nublando y probablemente las cosas cambien. Como quiera, ¿puedo utilizarlo en esa situación? Buena pregunta. Sí. ¿Y, y, ¿Y por qué? Porque recuerda que si es un plan, recuerda, una de las reglas de Going to es que es para hablar de acciones planeadas, de planes en el futuro. Si después la circunstancia cambia, tú igual puedes utilizar Going to. Pero recuerda, es una regla importante de Going to, que es de acciones planeadas para el futuro.
Okay. 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 Vamos a leer, okay. Mira, yo le, yo primero. I'm going to buy something special. Number two, Rita, you. You're going to get a present. Okay. Yo leo el siguiente. She's going to be 50. We're, we're going to send some flowers. Okay. They are going to have a party. Okay. Tina, what are you going to do for your birthday? I'm not, I'm not going to do an, anything special. Very good. Are you going to have a party? Yes, we are. We are, no, no, we're going to invite uh, all our friends. Okay. Or no, Arita, no. No, we're not. Okay. Uh, we're not going to the much. Very good. Exactly. Exactly. Very good. Okay. Okay. Arita, Vamos a dejar regresar al libro para ver qué actividad marca. Very good. Okay. Un segundito. Very good. Okay. Ahí está. Dejan lo pongo en el pizarrón. Ahí está. Okay, Anita. So it says, write questions with be going to using the prompts given. Then write your, uh, your own answers using indirect or pronounced where necessary. For example, el ejemplo. Dice, you do anything special for your next birthday? Es una pregunta, dice, are you going to do anything special for your next birthday? Y ya que es la respuesta, actually, my friends are going to buy me dinner. Okay. Aquí escribe la, la pregunta. Primero que escribe la pregunta, por ejemplo. Your parents buy you something nice on your next birthday? Very good. Your parents? Are your parents going, going to are your parents going to are your parents going to buy Very good. buy me buy you no are your parents going uh -huh. to buy you buy you uh, some some something nice Very good on on your next birthday very good exactly exactly very good okay vamos a la siguiente pregunta what do you get your friends for their birthdays what very good what are are you going to very good Going to get your friends. Very good. For the beer days. For the beer days. Very good. Beer days. Very good. Sakita says you and your classmates send your teacher a birthday card. Um, are, are, what? are you and your classmates good. going going to send your teacher? Your teacher a birthday, a birthday card. Excellent, good. Good, Anita. It says, when are your parents' birthday? 
what if you buy? Bueno, mira, la, la primera parte queda igual, ¿ok? When are you buying street days? Eso, eso queda igual, ¿no? Hay que modificar mm -hmm. what give, gives you buy. Parents. Parents uh, and Eso queda igualita. Ah. Exacto. A partir de ahí hay que hacer el cambio. What, what give Very good. Gifts are you going to buy? Exactly. What gifts are you going to buy? Very good. Okay. You need to, okay. What you buy your parents for their anniversary? What are you going to buy your Parents for their anniversary. Exactly. Excellent, Anita. Ok. Mira, ahora vamos a contestar. Por ejemplo, mira, yo te ayudo con la, con la número dos. Are your parents sí. going to buy you something nice on your next birthday? Bueno, yo diría así. My parents. My parents. My parents aren't going to my parents aren't going to buy me my parents aren't going to buy me anything okay special on my birthday okay. my parents aren't going to buy me Anything special on my birthday. Okay. Ahí, mi papá no me van a comprar nada especial para mi cumpleaños. Okay. Fíjate, aquí está el, el pronombre de objeto, buy me. ¿no? ¿Por qué? Uh -huh. Porque la pregunta es, ¿qué me hace alguien más a mí? ¿Sí? Que, que, que tú ya no me haces a mí. Tú, ya no, por ejemplo, me dice, ¿Are your parents going to buy you something nice on, on your next birthday? Y con esto, my parents aren't going to buy me anything special on my birthday. Okay. A ver, tú conoces la número 3. Yo, yo te pregunto, what are you going to get your friends for the birthdays? What are you going to get your friends for the birthdays? ¿Qué le vas a comprar a tus amigos por sus cumpleaños? Ah, sería I I am Very good. I am going to buy. Y ahí el pronombre de objeto. Them. Very good. Buy them a cake. I'm going to buy them a cake. Very good. Okay. Okay, Anita. Yo el número cuatro. Are you? Bueno, a ver, tú pregúntame. Are you? Yeah. Are you and your class classmates? Going to send your teacher a birthday card? Yes, sir. We, we are going to send him a birthday card. Okay. We are going to send him, okay, a birthday card. Okay. Okay, then you, you're the pregunta. When are your parents' birthdays? What gifts? Recuerda, gifts, regalos, okay? Presentes. What gifts are you going to buy? Um, his birthday. Their. Their birthdays. Their. 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 Birthday. Su cumpleaños, así, ¿verdad? Exacto, yes, yes. Birthdays. Birthdays is. No. The birthday on. No. Is is on. Casi, casi. Es plural. Sus cumpleaños son. 
their are, birthdays are very good. Are on January twenty fourth. Very good. And November twenty eighth. Very good. Very good. Y luego. Entonces, puede comprarles. I am going to Very good. going to buy their them. Very good. Them. Eh, no sé, anything special. Something special. Something ah. special. I'm going to buy them something special. Um. Very good. Something I am special. going to buy them something. Very good. Very good. I'm going to. It says the birthdays are January 24th and November 28th. I am going to buy them something. Something. Okay. Something special. Very good. Okay. Okay, Nita. Yo te pregunto. What are you going to buy your parents for their anniversary? What are you going to buy your parents for their anniversary? Um, I, I am, I am not, okay, I am not going to, very good, going to anything. <laughs> casi, 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 recuerda, <laughs> después de, de, del tú, Falta de verbo. Buy. I am not. I am not going to buy them. Buy them. Anything. Okay. I am not going to buy them. Very good. Okay, Danita. Very good. Okay. Entonces, today we were practicing simple present. Okay. Present continuous. Okay. And we were practicing. Okay. Object pronouns. Okay, and we were practicing going to affirmative, negative, and interrogative. And we continue with practicing object pronouns with direct objects and indirect objects, okay? And we were answering and answering some activities on going to, okay? So remember, Anita, the exam is tomorrow, okay? How, how, how do you feel for the exam? Uh, I I am nervous. <laughs> nervous, okay. <laughs> nervous. Remember, the, the exam is going to be from unit one, unit two, and unit three. Okay. okay. So going to look at this. This topic going to is unit four. So unit four, no. Okay. Yeah. okay. Just unit one, unit two, and unit three. Yes. Este, sería the present simple, present continuo. Exactly. Eh, o, obvious pronouns, idioms, phrasal verbs. Phrasal verbs. Exactly. Uh, that is the, the written the written section. Uh -huh. Also, also Anita, we are going to have the oral section, okay? A conversation. Okay. okay. Uh, okay. Using the questions we have practiced, con las preguntas que hemos estado practicando. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. okay Anita. Any questions, Anita? Any problems? Something mm, not clear. Tomorrow, eh, tomorrow, este, este, ¿cómo sería? I have a problem. <laughs> no, I will why? have a problem. <laughs> why, Danita, why? Eh, for the exam. Ah, <laughs> no, the exam must be, the exam, mira, te lo voy a poner, the exam, the exam must be a piece of cake. A piece of cake for you. The exam must be a piece of cake for, for you, then, okay? Debe ser un, muy fácil para ti. Okay. Okay? <laughs> okay, okay. Very good, Anita. Okay, so see you tomorrow in the exam. Okay, study, answer your recreo activities. Okay, and see you tomorrow, okay? Okay. 
See you tomorrow. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Take care. Thank bye, you. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.